All right, here with Summers County basketball coach Robert Walling and uh, basketball coach. Uh, it's always a good day when one of your players signs today. Brandon Isaac's one of the better guys probably that you've had come through here. Sign with Concord. Just talk about what Concord's getting in kid like uh, Brandon. I got you. Well, I think he probably is the most complete player that uh, that I have had as the uh, the head coach. We might have had a couple guys that could score a little better than him, uh, but I, but I think he's the most complete player. Um, and in addition to being a good player, he's also a, a great student, and uh, he's a high character kid. So it's not it's not, they're not just getting a good athlete; they they're getting a, a good person in their community and getting a good person in their school. Um, what does he do well that you think will translate and help him in his career? One, I think he one he's going to be able to focus on something instead of playing everything. Uh, <laughs> it's it's hard it's hard to get to improve a lot whenever you're playing something different every uh, every third month. Um, I, I think he's going to get bigger. And he's going to get stronger. Um, but I'll tell you something I think has that, that really translates to the game is, is he has that mid-range game. Um, he's not going to go down the middle lane and dunk on you, but he might pull up from 10 and shoot over top of you. Uh, so, so I, I think he did I, a lot of that in that Scott Brown game. He did, absolutely did. Now, I think he, he will be become a better three-point shooter as he gets stronger and just more repetitions. Uh, but I honestly think that's an easier – Characteristic, or that's an easier skill to develop than that pull-up game is, truthfully. What was he like in school as a leader, and just a, you know in his class and, and you know, around the school? He's not much of a, a talker. Uh, I mean, it doesn't mean he's, he's silent, but it, but he definitely leads with more example. But I will say this: when when he talks, uh, the kids tend to listen uh, because they yeah, they respect his ability and they respect his uh, his mindset and his demeanor. Uh, and whether that's in the, the classroom or, or on the court or the field, or what, whatever medium you want to talk about. Um, what do you expect to see from him there when you're all sitting down at Concord? What do you think will well, be I, the end of the story? I, you know, I, I don't watch them uh, a lot because, you know, that's, that's right in the thick of our season. But I do think he, he's going to have to get bigger and stronger uh, to compete at that level. But I have no reason to think that that, that won't happen. Uh, and I would say eventually he's going to contribute uh, to their team. And, and, and if it ain't 20 points a night, it'll be uh, in a lot of whole, a whole lot of other ways. Right. Hey, Coach, I appreciate the time. And uh, won't be long until we're talking round ball again. No, it won't. It won't. It never stops.